The new theory starts on a very small scale, smaller even than the quantum world of atoms and particles. It's at this tiny level that new things called primaries are shown to emerge from the void, which then go on to create the energy that builds the larger quantum world. In this theory, the void is considered to be like the figure zero, and this zero is really made up of plus one and minus one, like primaries, that exist in cancellation of each other. Gradually, over time, these primaries escape from the void, and collisions between them soon begin to occur. The secret of the new theory is in the nature of these collisions. So when the opposite types of primaries collide, it was found that their energy and their size increases, and when smaller primaries then collide into the larger ones, they cause the larger ones to split. This increases the numbers in what has been termed a breeding effect, hence the big breed theory. The mechanics behind this net growth goes on to show what now fuels a controlled, accelerating expansion of the universe, which is just what the astronomers have recently found. The new theory goes on to show how these primaries go on to create the larger quantum world, and it's at this stage that a big bang can begin that can go on to create the matter found in the universe. Dark energy is now proposed to be everything found in this sub-quantum world of the primaries. It's a place that provides the energy behind particles on the larger quantum world.